He'll watch a movie, then he'll tell you all about it. It's the Armstrong Entertainment Show. Hello, everyone, and welcome to Armstrong Entertainment. This is Chad here, and I saw the movie Christopher Robin, directed by Mark Forster and starring Ewan McGregor. And it also stars all of your favorite 100 Acre Wood friends, especially Winnie the Pooh. Now, this particular Winnie the Pooh is old enough to have a scotch. Now, Winnie the Pooh was one of my grandmother's favorite Disney characters, and whenever I hear his stupid voice or see him, I think of her. So needless to say, I have this connection with Winnie the Pooh, so I already knew I was going to like this movie regardless of how good it was. Now, I'll just get right into it. Disney is redoing all of their, taking all of their animated classics, such as 1977's Winnie the Pooh, and creating a live-action film. Now, obviously, there's been Beauty and the Beast, Cinderella, The Jungle Book, Maleficent, and this is their latest Winnie the Pooh. Now, I will just start off by saying there is no plot in this film. It is non-existent and not a lot happens. It's literally a ripoff of 1991's Hook, but just not done nearly as well and Ewan McGregor is no Robin Williams. It's basically about a guy who grows up, Christopher Robin, and he forgets his childhood and his imagination and all of his little fairy friends. Fairy friends? Pooh friends. His little friends. He forgets about all of them and it's horrible. This film was fun. I caught myself smiling whenever Pooh was talking because he is such an idiot. He is literally Yoda, but without the force, and he's not green, and he gives really good advice. He saved the movie for me. Every scene that he was not in, I was missing him, and I just wanted to, him to be in everything, which he pretty much was. All the other characters are fun too, but Pooh is just the saving grace. He's the one who's able to scoop up everything and just make you smile and enjoy what's, what you're watching, which is basically nothing. There are definitely some cute moments in this film, but I wasn't really sure if it was supposed to be a children's movie or an adult movie. It kind of falls in that weird limbo area that it, it's just not good for either audience. The children are kind of scared and the adults are kind of bored because nothing's happening. Oh, Piglet! Little Piglet isn't gay anymore, because we all know Piglet was definitely gay, but in this movie, he doesn't come off quite as gay as he usually does. So my opinion is, if Pooh is your jam, or honey, you will enjoy this movie just as much as I did. Otherwise, it is a renter, I am sorry to say. It's called Christopher Robin, and it is definitely playing in a theater near you. Until next time. He'll watch a movie, then he'll tell you all about it. It's the Armstrong Entertainment Show.